Hey coach, glad you found us on YouTube. A uh, couple things, first of all, subscribe. Hit that little bell and subscribe every time you come up. My personal goal is to get to 100,000, so um, share the word, share, share everything and subscribe. Second thing is go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better. Let me help you win more games in less time, 30 plus years, lots of state championships. You can see them, some of them right here. Um, let me help you become a better basketball coach. So go over and check it out and let's head off to the video. Last one, last one here. So give me two guys right here, top of the key, one over there and one over there. So one right here, another blue right here, I'm sorry. Right up here. And let's stack you guys. So again, you know, I, I'm, not re I'm not reinventing the wheel here. Um, there's a lot of different ways to do it. You know, you could, you could do a complete stack. You could do a partial stack. I think a stack like this is really hard for those two defenders to decide what to do. You know, are we going to worry about the person going deep? Are we going to worry about them catching the ball in front of us? Um, you know, we will do a lot of different things with, you know, rather than a 1-4 set, we'll do a 1-1 one, one, and 2 in the middle. It's still kind of a 1-4 set, but it seems like it's harder for them to defend. Um, because they're not sure what's going to happen with those two. <clears throat> what I usually do is have the second guy hit the first guy on, on, on the side and tell him that's the way he's going to go, and we curl him deep. And then we bring these three guys up, and then we flash. Um, we can, you can do lots of things. You can have them set screens and stuff, but we'll keep it pretty simple at this point. Again, it's putting the guys in the right spots. Where do you want them? If it's a zone press or a man press, you want... You know, the ball in the middle. You want somebody in the middle and you want people flashing in front of the ball. So, let's say you hit him on the right. He's going to curl right then. So hit him on the right. Yep, nope, you're going to go like this. You're going to go like this. Hit him on the right and he's going to go right. And you're going to flash high. And you two are just going to come up. Okay? That's all that's going to happen. And then as soon as the ball gets in, let's say the ball gets here. Okay? Yep, so you're deep already. Where do you think you're going to go? No, you're going to go sideline, you're going to flash in front, and you're going to flash middle. Okay, and you're going to step behind, or, or behind, yeah. You can go deep or behind. So what we're doing, why I like this one, is we have guys flashing in front of the ball. You can do the same thing, give me uh, the 1-4 set again. You can do the same thing with the 1-4 set. I just like it this way a little bit better, from the sense that, it, you know, you got, they're not sure if you're going to go deep. But let's say we have the 1-4 set, okay, like this, put the ball back here. And let's just have you two screen for the sake of screening. Doesn't really matter. You curl. All right, you two come up. You pass the ball here. Where would this guy go? Yep, he'd go in front. Where would you go? Middle. You'd go middle. You'd flash middle. You'd flash side and you'd flash back. Yep. So you want somebody flashing middle. You want somebody flashing in front of the ball. So come back and do that again. So the one four set, you can do it as a one two, one, or you can do it as a one, 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 four, but the ball goes to the wing. Nope. Uh, yeah, let's have you screen. That's a good idea. Have you screen. So you're going to flash in front of the ball. You're going to flash back to the middle right in here. All right. You're here and you're either deep or you're finding an open spot. So what you do is you have people moving in front. It's a two, two, one. It's a diamond and one. It's a man. You got them flashing. You have every spot that we need filled. If the ball goes, let's not have you guys screen. Come back here. See if my voice can hold up for the day. Go back. Let's say we just passed it here. Okay? And you turn. Where's ever You're going to flash middle, sideline, sideline. We're off to the races if the ball gets in the middle. If the ball goes to the sideline, we just want somebody flashing across. It is really hard to, to jam that. Because if you're here, let's say you're here, you're on offense for a second, flash and flash. Just flash here. Yeah. How am I going to stop him? Am I going to jam him like this? Am I, I mean, how am I going to, especially if I'm in a zone, how am I going to stop him when he's going 100 miles an hour in front of me? It's a really difficult thing to do. So that goes back to that, give me the one, two, one, where you curl deep. So come back here, stack it here again. You two stack right here, just like we were doing before. Either way, you know, I think we call this three, but um, you can do it the, the, this way, you can do it the other way. This one is really about the movement. It's about the flashing. So let's send him deep again. So, yep, you go deep. You guys just flash up, find one of them. 
Okay? Yep, you'd flash in front, you'd flash middle. He'd stay back. Okay? So let's try that again. Let's try that one again so that everybody can see it here on, on video and then... <clears throat> Go. Good. Turn. Good. And then curl. All right, stop. Now do the one four set. To be the last one here, and I'll give you guys a little break. Okay, go. Good look. Flash. Flash. Stop. Do it again. So that's something that does happen. They'll release. You know, don't, you know, don't leave the man in the foxhole when the enemy's coming. It's basically what I tell my guys. You better be in the foxhole with them. You know, I don't want, you know, you see, see Saving Private Ryan, they didn't leave the poor guys alone. You got to go jump in the foxhole with them. These guys were all off the races, and we had one guy back here. All right, so make sure we're flashing in front. Don't leave them stranded behind enemy lines. Okay, try it again. Go. Good. Flash in front. Middle. Good. And again, it will break down a little bit. Uh... As far as the, as the pressure goes, it will break down. Hey coach, so glad you enjoyed the video. Make sure you subscribe and like. Second all, go check teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better. Let me help you put banners and stuff in your gym and become a nationally ranked coach. Win more games in less time. Teachhoops.com is a community that will allow you to do that. Go over and check it out. And go check the next video out. Bye.